YouTube. Matase Dana. So my boy, your boy Roshi hit me up and he's like, hey yo, you should do a tier list. And my first thought is, what tier list? The fuck is a tier list? But fear not, we figured it out. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna do a tier list of the Street Fighter characters. This is not to be confused with a competitive tier list. It's not a competitive tier list. So if you're here to see my thoughts on a competitive tier list and like Street Fighter 5, Street Fighter 4, that is not what we're doing here today. Today, we're just listing off the best characters from best to worst. So first and foremost, we're gonna put Chun-Li in the double S tier because that's where she belongs. You feel me? That's where she's going and that's where she's gonna stay. So next we got Guile. My problem with Guile is that he's only got two special moves and uh, he's a pain in the ass to fight as chun -Li because he's got those booms and he's, he can follow up with the booms right after. He can anti-air the shit out of you with those damn normals. I have a hard time fighting him. I don't really like him. So we're gonna go ahead and put him in the B tier uh, just because that flat top is looking kind of strong. Otherwise, I'd put him in a basura tier. Tier, but we're not gonna do that. We're gonna put Geef in D tier. Uh, the reason why we're putting Geef in D tier is because I uh, actually despise uh, getting hit with wake up ultras, wake up supers, or when they increase the range on his SPDs for no reason, so he can grab you from like two range, two character lengths away. I actually hate the character. So we're gonna move on. Dawson. We're gonna also put Dawson in. Well, we're gonna put Dawson in the C tier. Uh, we're putting Dawson in the C tier just because he's whack. <laughs> Not, <laughs> if you play Dawson, don't feel any type of way. He's just a whack character. I don't really fuck with Dawson like that. Uh, Boxer. We're going to put Boxer in the A tier. Uh, I don't like him. I don't like him in the matchups. I don't like his character. I don't like his moveset. I don't like anything about him. But he's black. So we're going to put him in the A tier. Uh, Claw. We're gonna put Claw in the B tier with Guile because I think he's actually pretty cool. Uh, but sometimes, depending on if he has the Claw or not, or depending on what game he is, his uh, buttons beat Chun-Li's buttons. <laughs> I feel like this is starting to turn into a, a Chun-Li matchup tier list. <laughs> but he's actually pretty dope. And uh, one, of the, one of the best scenes from anime came from, from Claw. So actually, we're gonna put him in the A tier because that Street Fighter 2 anime movie was fire when he got kicked out of that uh that that wall. Next up we got my man Bipson. So I actually really enjoy Bipson. I think Bipson is a dope ass character. I like his moveset, I like everything about him. Like his the fuck is a double knee press. That just means I'm stomping your ass. He's got the freaking head stomp. He's got the devil's reverse, psycho crusher. Like what a, did, you, did you guys ever take the time out to go psycho crusher? Like you're psycho crusher. Like, what a name. We're gonna put him in the S tier. Just cause he's a dope ass villain. And I fuck with villains. Uh, T-Hawk, you already know what it is. Basuda, keep your ass down there. Nobody likes you, uh, except for bums. <laughs> uh, Fei Long's all right. We're gonna put Fei Long in the C tier with Sim. Just because, fuck it. DJ, DJ, I would put DJ in the Basuda tier. tier. Uh, and the reason why we're not gonna put him in there is cause that's a brother. So we're gonna put him right next to Guile. Since you want to buy these moves anyway, right? Uh, Ryu is a regular ass nigga, but he's still a cool character. So we're gonna put Ryu in the A tier. Uh, if it wasn't for Ryu, there'd be no Street Fighter, you feel me? Uh, Cammy's the waifu. Fucks with some Cammy, right? Especially if you could you could play some footsies with Cammy and get them drills off, you know what I'm saying? Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and put Cammy in the S tier next to Bipson, because I, I fuck with Cammy. Uh, Akuma the God. Right? Akuma the God. So, I like Akuma's moveset. I fuck with Akuma because he's evil as shit. You feel me? So we're gonna put Akuma in the S tier because that Raging Demon. When you catch somebody with a Raging Demon or when you see somebody get hit with a Raging Demon in tournaments, son, this is the best thing on the planet. <laughs> I fuck with Raging Demon. Uh, evil Ryu, that's another GOAT. We're gonna put Evil Ryu right up there with, next to Chun-Li because he's a GOAT. Uh, every iteration of Evil Ryu has been pretty dope. Uh, I fuck with him pretty heavy. Especially when they put him in four and they added the stomps. I was like, yo, what is this? What is this? And an EX stomp is an overhead? What is this? So we're gonna put him up there. Uh, Violent Ken. Violent Ken, you're gonna go up here in the S tier. Not double S tier, because you're not that cool. Um, the reason why I say he's not that cool, because I think he was only in, he was only in 
uh, SNK versus Capcom, SVZ Chaos, I think is the only game he was in. So I'm not entirely sure about this character because I played him for maybe 30 minutes. The 30 minutes that that game was hot, <laughs> I played him. So actually, I'm gonna put him in the A tier. Uh, Nash, he's all right. Not really much I can say about regular Nash because I mean, um, actually, I think he's pretty cool. I think Nash is pretty cool. Regular Nash, he's all right. He's all right because uh, he was an alpha and he used to throw them booms with one arm. You know what I'm saying? So we gotta put him above Guile. We put him right here. He didn't have the traditional Guile copy move set, so it's pretty fire. Uh, regular Ken, I always like Ken over Ryu just because Ken seemed to focus more on kicks and he had that fire and anybody who knows me knows my element is fire so we're gonna put Ken right above Ryu in the S tier because he's fire. No pun intended. Uh, Gen, I mean Gen's alright. He's an old dude. I mean, I don't really find nothing cool about him in my opinion. Like I don't like his supers really. I don't really like anything about him. Um, the Street Fighter Alpha, he didn't really give me any problems or anything like that. I just didn't think he was that cool, so D tier. Uh, Birdie, Street Fighter V Birdie, Basuda. Hey, nothing cool about him. Uh, Eagle, I always thought was pretty dope, just because of his stance. His stance was like a like a bounce. He's a bouncer, you know what I'm saying? So we're gonna put him in the B tier, you feel me? Uh, Adon, I don't know, I feel like I'm like a Sagat more. We're gonna put, we're gonna put Adon in the B tier. Um, just because his voice kind of annoys me, uh, but he, I mean he's a he's a decent character, but his voice annoys the shit out of me. His move set is all right, like the Jaguar kick and the Jaguar two. He's all right, but I'm not really fucking with him like that. Sagat the God though, we gonna put Sagat in the A tier because I fuck with Sagat. Sagat will grab you by the neck, kick you in the gut, throw your ass across the screen. You feel me? Like Sagat is OD. Fuck with Sagat. Um, e Honda. D tier. Ain't got nothing to say about E Honda. <laughs> Ain't nut, nut, nothing to say about him. If you main him, I'm sorry. I just don't really fuck with E Honda like that. He got back on. Blanca, straight Basuda. We not even going, we straight to garbage. Put your ass in the garbage. Don't fuck with no Blanca. Blanca sucks. Uh, we got to put uh, Guy. Guy's alright. He's cool. I mean, I don't really, really have much to say about Guy. So we're going to put him in the C tier. Um, Saddam. D tier. I don't have much to say about him. I've only played him in Alpha. I don't think he was in any other Street Fighter. Only I didn't even play him in Alpha. I fought against him in Alpha. And I only I, the, the only experience I've had with him in tournaments is when people played him with uh, uh, Bism, where they would just chop my ass with the damn size. And I, I can't I can't stand Saddam. He's pretty white. Uh, Rose, Rose is cool as hell. Uh, the concept of Rose being like a psychic and having the orbs and stuff like that. So we're gonna throw her in the A tier. Uh, I am we Dan, no words, Basuda. Um Sakura. Sakura is the waifu. We're gonna put her in the A tier. Um the reason why I'm putting her in the A tier is because even though I initially played her in four before I started to get my groove with Chun, um she was only alright. You know what I'm saying? Like I never I never was like damn Sakura, you know what I'm saying? Like I when I when I when I see her I don't think fuck Sakura, like oh shit, I'm hyped. She does have a dope ass theme though, so you know what? We're gonna put it in the S tier just because of that. Rolento, Basura. And we, <laughs> that's it, Basura. Right, we ain't got nothing to say about Rolento. Um, and that might be a, a you know personal thing because of how cheap he was in 4, but um, I've never really liked Rolento, especially in like Alpha. The Alpha games, he was alright. Armika, S tier. Facts. Facts. I like her in, in uh, um, uh, Alpha. Because of her her forward throw, her <laughs> that shit is awesome. How you sh the ring used to slide into the ring and she would jump off the y'all 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 bugging. That's S tier. Actually, no, that's double S tier. We're gonna put our beacon in double S tier. Uh, Karen, Karen was always dope to me in, in Alpha. Like I always thought she was sick. Original Karen, like she fought a five. Karen is cool, but she she wasn't exactly what I thought she was gonna be. I thought she was gonna be like a like a copy of uh, of um, um, her Alpha counterpart but she wasn't she's like kind of her own character so she, a lot of her moves she doesn't get until she activates v trigger so i didn't really like her in street fighter 5 but street fighter alpha karen s tier uh the dolls i don't really care for the dolls so we're gonna put juni and julie straight into b tier uh i always liked cody just because he threw rocks at your ass like i thought that was sick and then there was a knife on the ground you could pick a knife up and cut you 
But as far as like overall utility and alpha, I don't think he was that good. But that could be my own my own opinion. So we're gonna put him in the A tier. Uh, then we got Maki. I actually really like Maki. Um, I thought Maki was pretty cool. Uh, but I mean, I, I play females in fighting games anyway, so whenever I saw Maki, I thought she was dope. I only played her in Alpha for the PSP, I think it was. Um, but, you know, I thought she was dope. I thought she had cool buttons. So we're going to put her in the A tier just because she's, I don't think she's in any other game. Same for Ingrid. I really enjoyed Ingrid. Like, if they could put Ingrid in any other Street Fighter game, I'd be hyped because I really like Ingrid. Um, so we're going to take Ingrid and put her in the A tier. The same reason why Maki's in the A tier is because she's not in any other game except for like Capcom Fighting Jam I think which was trash uh, then we're gonna do Alex now Alex is a tricky one because I kinda like him in Street Fighter 5 but I like him more in Street Fighter 3 um, so we're gonna put him in the S tier cause I, I think he's a cool ass character uh, Dudley I think is fire too um, that whole let's fight like gentlemen I love that shit and he could throw a rose at you which would go into like an overhead and if you didn't parry it or if you did parry it it could fuck you up I fuck with Dudley we're gonna put Dudley in the S tier cause I think he's a dope ass character uh Yoon D tier Yang D tier y'all already know why we putting Yoon and Yang in the D tier cause fuck those characters I can't stand them um the twins they they don't suck as characters but I hate seeing them um they never made me hype except for Yoon in Third Strike when when Yoon used to hit you with the uh, Gnajin combos in Third Strike. That was hype, but getting hit by them shits is not hype. So D tier for you. Uh, Ibuki is okay. I never really thought anything of Ibuki. I mean her theme is okay, but like that's it. Um, that whole 50-50 shit to me is, is whack. <laughs> I don't like 50-50s. I mean I'm a Chun main, so who if you're a Chun main who likes 50-50s, right? So we're gonna put Ibuki in the B tier, cause pff, fuck it. Uh, Oro, Oro's all right, right? I guess he's okay. We we'll put him in the D tier, cause he's not trash. But like, there's nothing about him that I really fuck with outside of uh, he could blow your ass up. Um, he had infinite in third strike, which I mean it was cool, but it wasn't cool when you get hit by it. You know what I'm saying? Especially when you play in a top tier character like Chun, you get smacked with Oro combos. It's not fun. Uh, Necro is okay. We're gonna put him right next to Dalsim because he's a Blanca Dalsim hybrid, so cool enough to be near Dalsim, but not bad enough to be in the Basuda uh, tier with uh, Blanca. Uh, Elena, Basuda, if you feel a certain type of way, I'm sorry. She sucks. Her beat sucks. She sucks as a character, um, but she's black, so we're gonna go ahead and put her in the D tier. But she sucks as a character. I can't. I can't. Uh, Sean, he's a. I mean, I liked him in Third Strike because you could relate to him, you know what I'm saying? Like, he was just a regular dude, and he wasn't as jokey as Dan. Um, he wasn't all that good, but if you could beat somebody with Sean, you were a problem, so we're gonna put him in the B tier. Uh, Hugo, I didn't really fuck with Hugo either, so we're gonna put Hugo in the B tier with Geef. Uh, Yurian, as a character, is fire. So, we're gonna put Yurian in the A tier, because I think he's a fire character. Like, if you read his story, like, he's, he's a fire character. Uh, 12, the only thing that came out of 12 that was good is his theme. Other than that, 12 is Basuda. Uh, Q, he's cool, so we're gonna put him in C tier. Uh, mainly because he was, like, one of those odd characters, so I kind of fuck with odd characters like that, so we're gonna put him over there. Remy, Basuda. Yeah, I mean, Remy was a guy with clone. Um, he was just annoying as hell. Cause he had that, he had that crouch fierce that juggled. We, we gonna keep your ass in Basuda. Makoto, Makoto's bae. Makoto goes to the to the, to the S tier. I fuck with Makoto. Makoto had that deep damage, that disgusting damage. And then the stun locks. Oh my god! If you got stunned with Makoto and she had the perfect setup, you was done. Uh, C Viper. I hated fighting C Viper in Street Fighter 4. But you cannot discredit a mom who's a super spy. So we gonna put her in the double S tier. She's fire. Abel, Basuda. Seth, mmm. We'll put Seth in the C tier. He's alright. Goken, Basuda. Uh, Rufus, Basuda. <laughs> El Forte, extra Basuda. Like, we not even, we not even gonna explain that. The only people who like El Forte was El Forte main, so fuck that. He, he could stay right there in Basuda. Hakan? What was Hakan? Like, what was that? He and It's unfair because he came at a time when we were expecting better characters and they gave us that. 
Like, looks like it's time to oil up. That shit is garbage. Keep your ass in Basuda. Uh, Jury, I fuck with Jury real heavy, so Jury's gonna be in the S tier. I just love evil, like, evil characters, like evil women. We gonna put her in the S tier. She's got, like, the Capri. Uh, the Capri was alright. I didn't really fuck with her um, in Street Fighter 4 when they when they when they put her out. Um, I know she she was a doll before, like she was a part of the story before, but I didn't really fuck with the Capri like that. So the Capri's gonna go in the B tier, even though I like evil women. Uh, Poison. Now Poison is a tricky one, right? I like Poison's utility in any game that she was. Well, she was only in Cross Tekken in four, so I fucked with Poison's utility, like her her moves at her kit. Her kit was fire, but. Um, <laughs> with a kit come well, with with poison comes controversy because you know he's a dude, right? So we're gonna go ahead and put poison in the S tier because I fuck with poison as a character. Uh, Oni, Oni was all right. Uh, the best thing to come out of Oni was that theme in Evil Ryu. Um, I wasn't really a fan of Oni like that. Um, seeing him like when when what was his name? Was it Wa? I think his name was Wa. When Wa used to play him, oh my God, we're gonna go ahead and put. Only in A tier. Laura is Bay for uh, you know reasons, so we're gonna put Laura in double S tier. Nikali Basuda, uh, Rashid Basuda. Do we have any more room in Basuda? Yeah, we gotta put him in there because he's whack. That nigga is super whack. We're gonna put uh, Fong in Basuda as well, but we're gonna take Colleen and we're gonna take her all the way up to double S tier because she's fucking. Fi well, I mean she's ice, but she's fire. I like everything about Colleen. I like her theme. I like her character design. I like Kit. Like everything about Colleen, sick. I mean, her 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 normals are pretty stubby, but I would I would be happy if they kept her in like future Street Fighter games. Um, Ed Basuda. Actually, no. We're gonna put Ed in the C tier because he's alright. Uh, Falk. We're gonna put Falk in D tier because I like I honestly I played her for like 30 seconds. Um, not a, I'm not necessarily feeling her kit, um, but I was, you know, I'd put her in the C tier with Ed. Um, what's his name? Abigail Basuda. Now Manal, not Manal, Manat. The problem that I have with Manat, right? She destroys Chun. So I've never had an enjoyable experience with Manat. Not to say that she's a bad character or anything like that. I just never ever had an enjoyable experience with her. Not playing her. Not being. Not. Not fighting her, not playing with her. Like I've never had any. Even watching her in tournament, I'm not like, yo, I love this character, Basuda. Um, Zeku, I don't really care, Basuda. G, they say he's a Q clone. Um, I kind of like, I kind of like how he is. Like he's like the president of the planet. Like I thought that was pretty sick. We're gonna put him up here with the uh, B tier guys, and then Kage, right? Kage is kind of tricky because he he's evil Ryu, but then he's not evil Ryu, and that's what makes it kind of like, what are you then, right? Who are you? Uh, they say he's like Ryu Shadow, which is like trash, you know what I'm saying? But he's still technically evil Ryu, right? The thing that makes him suck to me is that evil Ryu's like ultras was fire. Kage's uh, super is trash. Like his super is garbage. Everything else about him is pretty sick, but that super is trash. We're gonna go ahead and put Kage in the double S tier anyway because he's still Evil Ryu. Y'all not gonna play me. I know Evil Ryu when I see him. But anyway, let me know what you guys think. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit me with a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe and hit that bell. You feel me? But I want to know your choices. I want to know. I know. I want to know what y'all think about this list. This is my personal list, not to be confused with a competitive list, you feel me? If you like it, cool. If you don't, let me know, right? I fuck with y'all. I will talk to y'all in the next one. <laughs>